Hello, uh, my name is Christopher Grant. I'm the general manager of Play Can Swadian Football Club in Cambodia. I'm originally from Scotland. Football has been a part of my life um, since I was a small boy playing football with my dad. So I've always been involved in football, uh, initially obviously as a fan and then playing as a young boy and through my teenage years. After high school, I went to college to study sports coaching with sports development and through that started to build a career uh, in football coaching. Uh, where I worked in academies in Scotland with professional clubs and then eventually ended up uh, being based where I am now in Cambodia. I've been in Cambodia for 11 years now, been at Swydean Football Club uh, for seven years. I ended up here at Swydean uh, after the club approached me uh, about coming in to, to support the development of the football club, initially overseeing the academy and the youth development programme, um, and now it has evolved into overseeing the whole football club day-to-day -day operations uh, and all the teams and departments that we have at the club. Swydean has a very strong history within Cambodian football and um, the club was formed in 1997 um, originally based in Phnom Penh which is the capital city. Our current owner, uh, he took over the football club in 2013 um, and is from Swydean province and renamed the club Prekanriat Swydean and relocated the club to Swydean. The club is one of the most successful football clubs in the country, it has won the Hun Sen Cup which is the FA Cup uh, more times than any other football club, uh, a record five times and has won the Cambodian Premier League three times. For the, the last season, 23-24 season, the club achieved a historic season of winning the double for the very first time. It has a very strong fan base. Uh, we are the only football club in Swydean province, so we sell out the stadium You know, every game, every home game. We have a very strong connection with the community, a uh, very strong presence across Cambodia with the football club. In terms of the legendary status uh, for Swydean, I think it has to be the club captain, Sui Vassal. He's also the record holder for the most appearances for the Cambodian national team. He's obviously achieved multiple trophies in this club. Uh, league titles and cup titles as well. So I think he has to be uh, probably at this moment the most legendary football player. Football in Cambodia is growing. Uh, every year uh, it is getting more professional, uh, more structured. Uh, the quality of games are getting higher, more intensity, and uh, more quality of coaches, both locally and internationally, and now participating in the league as well. A lot of clubs are investing into infrastructure, um, building training grounds, developing stadiums, creating you know proper structured professional football clubs as we know them across the world. Characteristics of players in Cambodia, and they're very, very hardworking, very humble people. They want to get better, they want to improve, they want to develop and they want to make Cambodian football better domestically in the country, but they also want to make Cambodian football stronger and more recognised uh, internationally as well. I think the future of Cambodian football is very bright. Um, I think it's going to grow to compete more on an international level, particularly the clubs and the international club competitions. We already seen last year one of the Cambodian clubs get into the semi-finals of the AFC Cup for the first time in Cambodian history. So I think we can only see a bright future for Cambodian football and growing within internationally um, and showing that Cambodia is a strong footballing country. Jeez, that's difficult. Eh? Who would you who would you say as Cambodians? Who do you think is the biggest? 
it's a difficult question. In terms of the biggest, I think it's difficult to name one. I think there's several. Sui Vassal, which I mentioned. I think Prat Moniadom has been an idol of Cambodian football for many years. Has played internationally in Malaysia, uh, Super League as well. Batanaka also a big idol in Cambodian football and has also played internationally, been in Japan. LCRT, the well, big chance, slid home beautifully by Sien Jante. And there is the goal that they deserve. In terms of the wonder kid, uh, I think it's probably Sian Chantia at the moment. He's a very young player in Cambodia, already in the national team and has scored goals at national level and has recently been on loan to a club in Qatar. So I think he's the wonder kid at this moment of Cambodian football and certainly one to watch for the future. I think the best football story has to be our story from last year. It's only the second time ever uh, in Cambodian football history that a club has done the double. The first time that we had ever done it as a football club. Um, so I think being a part of that, being able to share that experience with everybody associated with the clubs, internally and externally with the fans, to see the joy in their faces, to see the joy in our owners' faces, I think that, that's, a, that's the greatest story that I've been a part of so far. Hopefully there will be more of these stories, but yeah, to, to do the double uh, has been an incredible story and it's uh, been an honour to be a part of that. For me, personal um, kind of aspirations and ambitions for Cambodian football is obviously number one for our club to be successful um, and to achieve everything that we want to achieve, uh, which is developing young players, being successful on the field, competing and winning titles and cups, and on top of that, um, being very successful internationally and gaining respect for Cambodian football um, from leagues and clubs around the world. Um, that Cambodian football, you know, is strong, is professional. Um, and, and gets the respect that it deserves. So I hope that the work that I do uh, within my role can help Cambodian football achieve the goals that I think it can achieve and the respect um, and become more of an internationally renowned league um, of good professional football. My final message to everybody who's watched this is that uh, watch Cambodian football and support Cambodian football. It's a fantastic league, um, it's growing, it's very competitive, lots of entertaining games, lots of good players. Um, so please help the, support the league and follow the league and help it grow internationally. And I'm sure that you'll enjoy to see the development of Cambodian football over the years. Okay.